When you stop and reflect on where you started and where you've come and where your students have started with you, you see those changes in your students. You see how they take class more seriously or they start to invest in you as a person. To be able to see my kids growing not only academically but in their social intelligence and emotional intelligence as well, it tells me that I am making a difference. I'm part of a bigger tapestry that's helping make a difference in their lives. Ms. Holmes is one of the most wonderful people I've ever met. She has had one of the biggest impacts in my life. When I get older, I want to be a lawyer. Ms. Holmes encouraged me to go to college, and she basically said, you have to do all of this to be a lawyer, but I know you can do it because you're strong, independent, and you just have the power to do this. Ms. Holmes is a great teacher. She always tries to make us learn everything. I've learned about photosynthesis, chemical reactions, physical changes, chemical changes. She always makes sure that everybody understands everything. Soy mamá de Natalia Bustillos. Natalia me ha explicado o me ha dicho, verdad, sobre cómo se siente en la clase de ciencias. Ella le gusta. Ella está contenta. Le gusta experimentar, le gusta ver cómo se hacen hipótesis y cómo las van resolviendo en los experimentos y en lo que ella va explicando. ¿Sí? ¿Cómo, cómo les explica, cómo hace los equipos, cómo distribuye. Our core members who are teachers right now have been really successful in, in taking leadership roles. So our second years, both of them have become instructional coaches and they support actual core members right now. They've been taking on new experiences. For example, Ms. Holmes takes the kids to a climbing gym on the weekends, and we feel that they're constantly looking for ways to connect with students and the community. We also have some alums who have moved into administrative roles. We feel that they've been really connected here. A lot of them have been here for about five plus years, which has been really empowering for our school communities to see those same faces throughout, trying to constantly connect with our students and our families. We were founded in August 2015, and I've been lucky enough to be here since day one. Our population is primarily students of color. 94% uh, of them identify as students of color. Not only have we really exceeded the regional average for testing in the SAT and ACT, but also it's in a neighborhood that has history with educational inequality. But I think the biggest accomplishments that we've provided have been coming in the last week or so. The college acceptances that are rolling in are to schools like Penn, Northeastern, Washington University in St. Louis, these really prestigious universities that are accepting our students from this neighborhood, from this community. The parents, the students, our staff couldn't be happier. Maybe four years ago, the students didn't envision themselves going to college, and not only are now them getting accepted, but receiving financial aid packages that are going to cover the entire amount. They have a future that perhaps they didn't envision themselves in. One of my teachers, Mr. Casanova, I met him my freshman year. He helps us figure out what we want in our future. I feel like I do have someone I could turn to and like really figure out where I want to go to college and things. Mr. Casanova has definitely helped me with understanding exactly what I do need for colleges, my dream college, and the finances too. I can really say that I'm comfortable with him. He wasn't afraid to speak his mind and to tell people how it is. And so that's why I feel like I connected with him personally. I mean, I could just go on and on about some of the things that he has done for us. I remember he was awarding Jimmy sometime last spring for a student of the month. Mr. Casanova called me and said, well, Kena, you know, I'm giving him this. It's gonna be a big surprise if you could come support. A lot of times people think that because they're high schoolers, they're on their own and they, you know, the parents lose that connection, but they have made sure that I am in the loop and I'm a part of that. And Mr. Casanova is a wonderful example of that type of teacher. I think academically, our students have accomplished a ton. We've been rated the number one high school our first year, number two a couple years ago, and number one high school again last year. And that's on Denver Public Schools school performance framework, their evaluation system. We had the highest ELA growth in the entire state of Colorado two years ago. ACT, SAT scores, our students are doing incredibly well on those tests as well. And that is paying off now with them applying to colleges. So those things matter to our kids and to their families. TFA has had an awesome impact on our school. They have been an integral part since really the very beginning. We had two new core members our very first year and five additional alumni. 
and as in a founding staff of 11. We could not do our work, we could not reach our bar of excellence without TFA core members and alumni. So one of the aspects of our program that allows our core members to be so successful is the training and support that TFA provides. That includes your summer training, which happens before you go into the classroom your first year. Throughout your two years, you'll have a TFA coach who will come in and observe you teach and give you feedback on that. There are also various certification programs and master's degree programs in each of our regions that our core members are able to access during their two years. You know, I truly believe that in order for a kid to have a transformational life or to learn, they need a good teacher in front of them, food in their bellies, a roof over their head and a safe place to live. So transportation, housing, health, and health justice has been something that I've been really interested and passionate about because at the end of the day, it's helping the community that I taught, the community that I'm from because I am an immigrant and really making sure that everything that I was doing is affecting people's life.